This is the EVGA Z15. And although I really enjoyed modding and painting it for my wife Jay, in the end it doesn't have the aesthetic we both wanted. This came down to color choice and little details like the obscure EVGA branding that made other boards more aesthetic from a visuals perspective. That being said, I do have to hand it to EVGA. They did their homework. If you are a returning viewer or like this video, please consider subscribing. This board checked most of the boxes. From the hot swap sockets to the extremely satisfying volume roller, this board was a great basis for modding. The black aluminum finish looked great to begin with, and the build quality, like the magnetic wrist rest and the inclusion of aluminum weights, really made this board stick out from the vast majority of consumer boards you can get. The negatives of this board were the APS keycaps, non-detachable USB cable, and the branding being a little too front and center, literally. The switches that came with the EVGA were Kale Speed Silvers. They weren't too bad to take apart, lube, and reassemble. The PBT Totoro keycaps I bought for my wife were from a Chinese seller on Newegg. I did pay a little too much for them at the time, but was happy with the quality of the die sublimation. The tray mount design with around 16 screws was easy to take apart, but there were some screws under the rubber feet on the bottom, which is always annoying to deal with. Painting the plate went extremely well. The two thin coats of primer and two coats of matte top coat went on easily and cleanly. When painting with rattle cans, be sure to do some test sprays. The nozzle distance should be around eight inches from the plate and make sure that you use smooth movements. Being in a well-ventilated area is a must. After letting each coat dry for just over an hour and the final coat dry for a couple more, the board was ready to assemble. The paint matched the color we were going for, but it didn't hit a home run for us in the end. I may try to repurpose this board and repaint it in the future, but for now, we're going to break in the switches and enjoy the experience. Here's a sound test. If you liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Thanks. Come over to mama. Is this is this red light flashing? Right there. <laughs>